Hi, it's John. It's the 3rd of August 2014 and I was going to mention in a video about the term, I was going to use the term catch-22 and um, I thought, well, people, some people won't know what catch-22 means, so I better explain what catch-22 is. I mean, most people will know what it is, won't they? But uh, it all relates to the Vietnam War and I think it's a book uh, about the Vietnam War and in the 1960s and 70s the Americans had something called the draft where young men were drafted into the army to go in go and fight in the Asian war go and fight in Vietnam against communism and uh, there were quite a lot of different ways to avoid it I mean, you could become a Muslim like uh, Muhammad Ali or um, another thing was to feign madness or to actually be mad. This is, and this is Catch-22. So if you feigned madness or you were mad, then you couldn't join the army um, because they didn't want mad people in the army. Uh, but, but really, um, if you feigned madness or were mad, you were actually sane because, um, you know, you would avoid being called up and to shoot people and get shot yourself. So uh, you're in a, that's, that's where the term catch-22 comes from. Um, uh, that uh, the, 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 the actual mad people are the sane people and the sane people are a bit mad because the sane people would go into the, uh, into the war and do all those horrible things, napalm and everything else. Right, bye for now.